In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up the 21 CFR EasyLog USB Data Logger. Our 21 CFR software is an administrator-based system, so before you can use the data loggers, you are required to set up an administrator. Where it says login name, create a username between 3 to 15 characters. Next, type your first name and surname. This will appear as a signature on the session data and audits. Then, create and confirm a password that must contain a minimum of 8 characters and at least one letter and one number. Once this is complete, click Next. The following page is Email Settings. This is used to notify the administrator by email if a recipient has entered their password incorrectly three times. Next, add an outgoing mail server, port number, username, password, and from address of the administrator. You may need to contact your IT department for the following. The help file contains some standard settings for email providers such as Gmail, Outlook, and Yahoo. If you are unsure of this information, you can input this data at another time. Just click skip and continue on to the next step. The final setup page is software settings. By company name, if required, input your company name. This will appear on the session data and audits. By password life, you can decide the mandatory password change timetable per user with the minimum of 7 days and maximum of 9,999 days. By auto logout time, you can choose the amount of time of inactivity before the user is automatically logged out. Once these are complete, click Save. If you are unable to set up your email configuration the first time, click here and it will bring you back to the email settings page. If you need to add additional users or make changes from setup, on the top left corner on admin, then under admin select create new user. Create a login name, first name, and surname. On the user rights tab, you can tick off the boxes to determine the authority you would like the user to have. Then click save. If you need to edit a user, under the admin tab there is an option to edit user. You will be able to change the login name, first name, surname, and user rights. Once you have made the necessary changes, click Save. If you need to edit software settings, under the admin tab, select software settings. You will be able to change the company name, password life, and auto logout time. Once you have made the necessary changes, Click Save. If you need to edit email settings, under the Admin tab, select Email Settings. You will be able to change outgoing mail server, port number, username, password, and from address. Once you have made your necessary changes, click Save. To view the software audit, under the Options tab, click View Software Audit. This will show you the user, action, date slash time, serial number, session, and any comments made. On the bottom left corner, you will see the plus sign that says Advanced View. Click here and it will bring you to a more detailed software audit with the user, user GUID, a unique reference to the user setup on this PC, so you can differentiate between multiple users with the same name. Action, date slash time, serial number, session, SDGUID, comments, PCGUID, and ESGUID. Now that the setup is complete, you can plug the USB data logger into a port on the computer.